Thanks for coming in. Have a good one. Natsuki, I'm really impressed with how hard you've been working this new year. Wasn't this supposed to be just a temporary job for you? Yes, at first, but I'm happy to keep working for now, if that's okay. Of course it is. Once I got the job, I realized something. It's harder than I thought to earn decent money at a job you actually like doing. Isn't that the truth? Hello. Hi, and welcome to Fastburger. I'll be happy to take your order when you're ready. Just let me know when you've made up your mind. Oh, hey, Natsuki, what's up? Aw, oh, don't do that. Don't act like you forgot about me. Uh, Miki, hi. Tell you what, just set me up with a cheeseburger and a shake. Yeah, okay. Give me a cheeseburger shake combo all day. <laughs> so what do you say you join me for a little drive, baby? I'll just take you home. Oh, no thanks, I'm fine. Hold on, you look like you're worried. I won't bite, it's not like I'm a rabid dog, lady. Keep it down, fine. <laughs> My shift will be over in another half an hour. I thought I'd come home for winter break, see what things had changed. Never expected to see you working, though. You sure have changed a lot in a short time, you know that? That's funny, because I sure don't feel any different. You've changed, though. Grown up. More attractive. More of a woman. You got a boyfriend on your arm these days? I don't see how my love life is any of your business. Which says to me you're currently a little more than single. I'll try not to feel too broken up about how you pretended you forgot about me earlier and we can go straight to having a whole lot of fun together like we used to back in the good old days. This is fine. Pull over. What? What are you pissed about? I have no intention of going out with you now or ever again, so you should just leave me alone. I may not have a boyfriend, but I do have someone in my life that I care for very much. And he's more precious to me than anyone. So goodbye. <laughs> Don't sweat it, baby. Just spend a few more minutes with me and we can talk all you want about this guy of yours who's so freaking precious. This is scary. He's lost it. We're out, you guys. See you tomorrow. I haven't seen it snow like this in a while. It's really coming down out here. Talk to me. Wait up a sec. You want to hang out? Huh? I don't know. I probably can, but... Come on, you don't have anything to do at home, do you? No. Where are you taking me? Someplace no one will bother us. Somewhere that you and me can be alone. I mean, the night is young. Talk to me. So the Nikitani said to me, uh, Hey, something wrong talking to me? On second thought, I'd better not go. Why not? You know, I just don't feel like it. Dad went to a New Year's party with some of his old drinking buddies, so I'm willing to bet he'll get all liquored up and need me to give him a ride home later on. Let him find someone else. See ya. Huh. Sounds like it's about time to move out of Dad's house. <sighs> Sweetheart, you and I used to have a hell of a lot of fun together, don't you remember? You listened to what I said and did anything and everything I wanted you to do. <laughs> Let that cat out of the bag. What do you say? No way! Want to tell me why not? I'm not the same person I used to be. <sighs> Don't give me that! When did you get to be such a boring old cow? What happened to you? I mean, you used to be the kind of girl who knew how to show a guy a decent time! Yeah? Well, maybe I found out what a guy should be like. Right. Come on, quit acting so naive, Natsuki. Here. Fine, run. It's
It's not like you can escape! Talk to me, answer the phone, please! You have to pick up! Yeah, that you, Dad? Talk to me, Dad, help me! Come to the lake! Hello? Are you in trouble? What's going on? Hello? Hello? I've never heard her that freaked out. What lake? At Akina? You were yelling at Takumi just now, weren't you? The guy you were talking about is Fujiwara? Is that it? You're in love with Takumi? I can't believe you fell for a little punk like him! Damn it! <laughs> I don't know how you could do this to me, Natsuki. I can't believe you ditched me for some friggin' loser jerk. You're gonna stop talking like that, and you're gonna stop it now. <laughs> for an underclassman, you're about as cocky as you are stupid, Takumi. Seniors don't take that kind of crap! No. I always hate remembering that. You know... <laughs> he's gonna do the same thing to you again. You little... You should have used that tiny brain of yours before you called your boyfriend. Tell me something. How's he supposed to get here without a car? Takumi is faster than almost anyone else around when he drives on the mountain. He what? Wait, he has a car? Get up! Get off the ice! Move it! Go with me! You're coming Make with me whether you like it or not! Stop! Shut your stinking mouth and get in the car! Do it! Farther down the mountain where nobody will bother us. Hold on to your socks, good looking. I'm not letting you go till I've got everything I want, and I mean every tasty little lick. He's out of his mind. I don't know how to get out of this. Hurry, talk to me. piece of white garbage that's about 150 years old. <laughs> Come down, sweet cheeks, that trip was nothing. Natsuki, I hate to break the news to you, but it's impossible to keep up with my car in a chunker like that. I don't care how good your car is. If anyone's fast enough to stop you, it's Takumi. What a bunch of crap. It doesn't matter if he's terrible or the world's best driver. My car's a four-wheel drive. And if you knew anything about cars, you'd know the four-wheel drive runs better on snow than any other car on the road! <laughs> snow is nothing to a car like this! I just make three more curves and that will be the last I see of your Mr. Hero in my rearview mirror. What the hell? How did he do that? Damn it! Impossible! How could a relic like that? 
that tailgate a four-wheel drive! It has nothing to do with how old his car is. You're just driving too slow. You think because your boyfriend's pulling in behind me, you can insult me? Keep your eyes on the road, you're gonna wreck! I don't get it, he's on me like a damn shadow! See if you can follow this! Crap, that's not good. No, he won't turn! Natsuki! I'm so glad that you came for me. What's all this about? I could barely understand you on the phone, so I just got here as fast as I could. Who's the guy in the car? You know him? I'll tell you once we get out of here. Can we please just go? Are you mad at me? I'm sorry. None of this would have happened if I hadn't been so stupid. Don't worry about it. I'm so sorry. I'll give you a ride back home. This doesn't have to be anything more than that. I can't go back home. At least not like this. I... I don't think I'll ever have another chance to say this to you, so please listen. Will you do that? The man I was going out with, you know, the man with the bends? I don't know how to say it other than just to come out with it. I was getting money from him. I regret doing that more than anything. It makes me feel so bad inside. Every time I took his money, I felt a little piece of me lift away. Like, like the important part of my soul was flaking away into ashes. The whole reason I took the job at the burger place was because I thought I could get back some of what I lost. And because I wanted to show you I was trying hard to be different. <laughs> I wanted you to look at me and see me for what I truly am. Forget it. Never mind. You must think I'm so silly for crying like this. Well, I hate doing it. I just wish I could stop it already. I'm terrible. When did I become such a crybaby? You'd think a girl telling you these stories would be a little tougher. I'm sorry. I'm sorry you talk to me. It's my turn. I have something I want to say to you, too. And this is how I really feel. I... I love you, Mogi.